Mr. Vitale, the pressure is on both teams in this third round tournament game between the Washington State Cougars and the BYU Cougars. This place is rocking and rolling, baby! The Cougars might be looking at the fight of the season tonight, Dick. Any particular keys to victory for them? For them to win tonight, the keys are as follows. First, play at your own tempo. Don't get into a run-and-gun game, baby. Secondly, get the ball to your big man on the block early. That'll open up the perimeter game, baby. And lastly, make good decisions with the rock. Don't turn it over, baby. Well, Dick, let's get down to the court, and let's get the action underway. Boy, you go with all cylinders right in the opening seconds. They didn't waste any time attacking the basket. He comes away with it. They're off into transition. Barry's at home. They move it into the front court. On the elbow, they feed down to the low block. The post kicks it back out for three. That's good. Inside. Leaning in, trying to draw contact. Basket falls despite the contact. Brewster receives the ball. He shoots the jumper. Great job of running the defender into the screen for a nice J. The Cougars have a mismatch in the post. This may be a good opportunity for them, Brad. There's a double team waiting there. The Cougars have got to continue to get him the ball. Brad, he's on fire. Adam, momentary look from three-point land. Great pressure, great double team. Really explosive. Okay, here we go. For the bucket. Great play to take that to the basket. Fed the low block. Brewster receives the pass. He shoots from the elbow. Goes in. Here's the big man with a drop step. Oh, he does a phenomenal job getting post position, good angle, and then the drop step. Shows patience, waiting for the reset. Takes the pass in the paint. Down he goes, and no foul called either way. Wow, no call. I can't believe that one. Those long arms trying to get it in front three quarters. I'll tell you one thing. That big guy down inside, though, is so big that really it's tough to buy him the ball. Gave it up. You better get rid of it, Brad. Perfectly executed. <laughs> On the dribble, gives it up. The power forward handles the pass. And has it rejected. Defense did a great job with the block shot. And the ball goes out of play. They've got a player spotting up on the three. High post flasher is open. He uses the shot fake for two, and he scores it off the glass. Work the perimeter. Spacing so important, get 15 to 17 feet apart. He rejects it. And the ball goes out of bounds. Too much. That's a foul. And he's going to pick up the foul and all oh, look at the look on his face. I'll tell you what, he's disgusted, but so is his coach.
He's got the post flashing if he wants it. Sets a screen for his teammate. Stolen away. They work the perimeter. Inside. Tries for two. They really seem to be letting this one get away, Dick. Yeah, there's been a breakdown somewhere. They need to talk this one over, Brad. Trying to pack it inside. Good defensive stance there against the spin move. Well, the key is to beat him to the spot, and he did a great job. He anticipated that spin move. Isolated on the outside. They work it around the arc, looking for the open jumper. They let him get into a rhythm. <laughs> on the outside. Goes up for two. And he scores despite the hack. Ross is feeling great out there right now. Well, you know, Brad, these student athletes play with fire and emotion. You rarely see that in the pros. They'll work it around the arc. Got an open look if he wants it. Time to pick up the defense here now. He fires it up. It's good. Gave it up. Hayes handles the feed. That spin move's not going to work against a defense I'll like that. Tell you, they did a great job scouting post play because they were really anticipating the spin. Got to take some pride on the defensive end. Looking for contact. He puts it in with contact and all. He squares up down on the low block. I tell you, teach your player to face up and get in triple threat position. You can drive, shoot, or you can pass. Dick, how's he working him defensively? I tell you, he's trying to front right now. You've got three concepts. You can play halfway, you can play behind or in front. They've decided to play in front, which means you got to get help soft. He'll regroup the offense. Excellent spacing. That's so important to a good offensive set. It's even more important to have talented guards up there. Yeah, that helps. Washington State are on a run right here as of late, Dick. Yeah, they've started to put it together on offense. Can they keep it together, though? That is the question. For the bucket. I love the sky hook, especially when you get great post position on the interior. come with a double team to stop it. He stole the ball. Great pressure there. Fantastic ball pressure. The pressure got to the ball handler, and he lost it. Too physical. Oh, the cheerleaders into it big time for their team. They are really involved. I'll tell you one thing. They bring a lot of spirit. He keeps the dribble as they reset. Executes the baby hook. I'll tell you, great shot. I don't understand why it's not utilized more often. It's so impossible to block that shot. Oh, poor job. Poor job offensively. I'm coaching. He's sitting next to me as an assistant coach. He's <laughs> pounding the ball with a deck. Where's he going? Puts it up, looking for contact. They are heating up this building where they're shooting right now, Dick. The hits just keep coming, baby. Picked off. On the dribble, gives it up. Takes care of the ball until the offense resets. Looking for a good shot. Tries for two. Great play to take that to the basket.
defensively doing a great job down there, and he's winning that battle there. I think it's very essential that you establish close position by moving that offensive player out, and that's how he's winning that battle. Gave it up. Boy, terrible execution on offense. Trying to draw some contact. BYU are on a bit of a run. Let's see how long they can keep it on, Brad. Great defensive play. Anticipated well. When you're an anticipator, you've got a chance to do well. A lot of guys, they're reactors. If you're a reactor, you're one step behind the action. On the outside. Jumps in. Drops the bucket despite the harm. Double team now, bad angle. The lay in. All right, let's check in. Third member of our team again. Here's Aaron Andrews. Well, Brad and Dick, I don't know if you can hear it from where you are, but I can hear it clearly. The coach is stressing to his team go inside, go inside. They've been effective in this area all night long. What an asset to have. All right, Aaron, we're going to watch that the rest of the game. I'll tell you one thing, you better be able to establish post play because that gives you inside outside action. Leans in. He keeps the concentration off the contact for the score. Fakes the shot. He goes with a baby hook. He sinks another basket. What are they going to do with this guy, Dick? I don't know, Brad, but they better do it quickly. I'll tell you, he missed the post guy. The post guy had the great angle, was locking on a box. Fires away. BYU are putting together a pretty good run here. Execution's been the key, baby. Great elevator man, man. That's the elevator guy. What a high riser. Both teams looking to get things going here. Thinks about the shot. He was looking for the call, and he got it on himself. Offensive foul. Definitely an offensive foul, no doubt about it. He beats him to the spot. There's the fake. Executes the baby hook. The Cougars have a hot hand right now that's scoring for them at the moment. They need to keep feeding the ball. It's simple. They work it around the perimeter. Up fake. Run him right into the screen again. What did I say? Runs him first, Dick, and then works behind. Yeah, he's playing from behind me because that tells me right there they don't respect him as an offensive player. And they made an error, obviously, but they don't have the great respect. So they're saying, you know what? Let him get the ball and let him try to beat us. Let's check in courtside with Aaron Andrews. Aaron? Well, Brad and Dick, with the score so close, both teams seem so intense on their benches right now. Both coaches have told me it all comes down to turnovers and miscues. All right, thanks, Aaron. Way off target. Got a nice screen from left of the circle. He couldn't get it to fall. Looking for the foul. Pace makes the finger roll. Here's a double team. Up and inside. A high screen. Off the rim and no good.
He goes for three. Washington State have put together somewhat of a run here. Maintaining it is the key, though. They've got to continue to make the hustle plays at both ends of the court. From the baseline, they'll bring it out on top. Pump fakes. There's a high screen. He launches a three. He drains the shot. Number 34 with the fake. Fakes a jumper. Swatted from behind. Never saw him coming, Brad. Phillip. He gets the tough layup and a foul to go with it, Dick. Hey, that was awesome, baby, with a capital A. What a play. These kids are fired up now. And if you're going to celebrate, why not celebrate with a teammate? I'd celebrate too, partner. They are playing some great basketball at the moment. it up. There's a bad pass right to the defender. Up it inside. He takes a three. Shot was no good, baby. Beautiful use of the screen, though. That's been moved. Not going to work against the defense like that. I tell you, they did a great job scouting post play because they were really anticipating the spit. There's a nice block from behind, Dick. Yeah, that's good timing for the defense. The Cougars have found a player who cannot seem to miss Dick. Well, he's on fire. Dick, he really seems to be getting great position down there in the low block. Yeah, he really is gaining possession because he gets the good angle, and they also have the good entry from the wing. The skip pass is picked off. Hey, this crowd will be ecstatic if they can get a basket. Puts it up. Way off target. The Cougars will have their fans going silly if they can get a stop here. He unloads. He puts in another score. He can see the light, Brad, and it's hanging right over the goal. the perimeter entry pass in the paint up and in <laughs> this is what you're supposed to do down low is go up strong I tell you, that was great post play put it 101 and how to explode to the goal The defender right on his hip, and I think he's holding his ground, Dick. Doing a great job. I tell you, doing a phenomenal job not allowing the offensive player to seal him off. Tries to get the D to bite. And has it rejected. Defense did a great job with that blocked shot. We're going to move it around the perimeter. In the paint. His shot blocked from behind. He set him up nicely. Looking for a screen on top and got it. From left of the circle. He drains it. up for two. Perfectly executed. <laughs> Gave it up. He lets it go. Scorches the net. Work the perimeter. Spacing so important. Get 15 to 17 feet apart. Dickey's working on that low block on that right hip. 
I'll tell you one thing, he's trying to deny the ball initially, but the defense really doesn't do a great job of sealing them off. Pass down low, there's a drop step, and oh, good defense. I thought defense reacted and beat him to the spot. Very poor job with the drop step, very slow. Looking for a good shot. On the dribble, gives it up for the bucket. Great play to take that to the basket. Trying to draw the foul. Nice job to create the angle using the glass. Takes the pass in the paint for two. Perfectly executed. And there's a lazy pass. It's stolen away. Turnover. Will it turn into two the other way? Trying to get that ball movement, get that good spacing. Tries to turn, and the defense comes up with a play. What a terrific play to stop that spin move. Tries for two, in and out. Steals a pass. Leaning in, trying to draw contact. Opportunity for two for one. Picked out of the air. Dickey's really sticking to his man defensively down there. I thought doing a great job fronting him, trying to beat him to the spot, playing in front, making him throw the lob pass over the top. If you get help, you can take that pass away. Intercepted. Shot clock is dead. He looks for three. He nails the bucket. This is great hustle and great defense in the steal. I tell you what, they telegraphed that pass and he read it perfectly defensively as a post player. At halftime, the Cougars are up by four. Well, Dick, so far we've got a close one. Any play that sticks out to you as the highlight of the half? My highlight of the first half has to be this trifecta, Brad. It showed another one of the deadly weapons that this team has offensively. I expect more of that in the second half. Second half about to get underway. Let's go down to the action. BYU is shooting very well from the floor right now, Dick. They're getting good looks, man, and they're not letting them go to waste. That's how you win games, man. Offensive execution. Let's go courtside. What do you got for us, Aaron? Well, Brad and Dick, as you can imagine, both coaches were very intense as I met with them at halftime. They said at this point, it all comes down to playing their game, having fun, and enjoying the moment. Guys? Thanks, Aaron. Take another look at that play. With the jump hook, can't get the shot to go. They've got a three-point shooter spotting up. The power forward gets the ball. For the deuce. I love the sky hook, especially when you get great post position on the interior. That's basic. The center gets the pass. Number 30 is receiving great praise from the fans. Yeah, they really know how to show their appreciation for him. It. He saw that developing. He was right there when the ball left his hand. Top of the circle, they work it around the perimeter. There's the rejection. The ball goes out of bounds. 
You start comparing these backcourts, Dick. What are your impressions so far? You know, well, for me, Brad, good guard play will take you a long ways. If you think about teams in the past, they all had good guards who can apply good ball pressure, attack off the dribble, and distribute the ball. I can't emphasize enough how important backcourt play is. They strip him in a basketball. Got a little too fancy. Too much mustard there. The small forward takes the feed. This team right now just lighting it up from everywhere. Hey, they're finding each other in rhythm with their passing, Brad. That makes a huge difference in how shooters shoot. This defender is resilient. Still applying pressure. Nice fake. The ball goes out of play. Oh, and this packed house is showing their appreciation for their team. Well, there's euphoria out there. They're really excited. They're going bananas. And they get the turnover. Washington State have a nice little run going here. Can they keep it up, though? No one's proven otherwise just yet, Brad. Runs him first, Dick, and then works behind. Yeah, he's playing from behind him because that tells me right there they don't respect him as an offensive player. And they made an error, obviously, but they don't have the great respect. So they're saying, you know what? Let him get the ball and let him try to beat us. On the outside. For the bucket. He's money with the shot. How about this? the steal and they do for two easy one the Cougars are trailing by six step out on that screener he shoots from the top of the key he hits a bullseye again and he's feeling it from everywhere baby up and inside now they'll bring it up. There was no doubt about that one. The Cougars lead by six. The center with the ball. Can't get the shot to drop. And the ball goes out of play. Nick, look at the number of points off turnovers. I'll tell you, getting baskets off turnovers is such a great and easy way to score, Brad. You want to maximize these opportunities as much as you can. The shooting guard takes the pass. He puts it up. He makes the shot. it rejected. Defense did a great job with that blocked shot. Washington State is showing a bit of a run here. Things are going their way right now. Adam in the low block but opted against it. Adam momentary look from three-point land. He kept his dribble and ran the defender right off the screen for a beautiful jump shot, Brad. Ball was loose, but the offense got it back. He makes the block, and the ball goes out of bounds. Controlling the ball. The post flashes up high if he wants it. That's an ill-advised shot. I don't think that's the guy you want shooting from the three-point line. That shot was definitely ill-advised. Turnover City now always really negate any offense. He draws a foul. 
Well, Dick, what's the front court production looking like to you? Well, you know, Brad, your bigs really can influence how your teams play. Rebound, blocking shots, opening shots are all very important skills which your big players should possess. Take a look right here. Nobody steps into the driving lane. He allows him to get the crease, the lane, the angle. Gave it up. Good job defensively. That spin move's not going to work against this defense. That's a no-no, baby. A defensive player beats him to the spot. There's the screen up on top. They'd like to get it inside to the low block. Unable to so far. Nice job of packing it in defensively. Yeah, really doing a great job packing it in. Done a great job of anticipating that lateral pass. Look out. He's in the face of the opposition. I don't know if all of that is necessary, Brad. High post flashes for the ball handler. He squares up down on the low block. I tell you, teach your player to face up and get in triple threat position. You can drive, shoot, or you can pass. Looking for a good shot. Tries for two. Great play to take that to the basket. to three, makes the shot. Playing for the steal in the post, and he didn't get it. I'll tell you, trying to make the spectacular play, but now he's embarrassed. Takes the outside jumper. Yes! Goes out of bounds. They're feeling good. The momentum is on their side, and everything is falling into place. Their body language, Dick, says it all. They're definitely having some fun out there. Shooter spotting up on a three. Gets it back out. That was like a NASCAR wreck and no whistle. Wow, no call. You like that NASCAR? Hey, where's Mr. Petty? The Cougars are ahead by five. Robs him of the ball. Working it around the perimeter. Works the perimeter. Spacing so important. Get 15 to 17 feet apart. Set that screen away. Goes up for two. Sweet looking shot. He is super. He really is. <laughs> Gotta think right now. Gotta focus defensively. He launches the bomb, knocks it down. On the dribble, gives it up. Great defense. Excellent spacing. That's so important to a good offensive set. It's even more important to have talented guards that they have. Yeah, that helps. The Cougars are ahead by eight. He'll kick it back outside. He intercepts it. Looking for contact. Basket falls despite the contact. It 
Dickey's working on that low block on that right hip. I'll tell you one thing, he's trying to deny him the ball initially, but the defense really doesn't do a great job of sealing him off. He attempts the three. Dick, they are on a deadly tear right now outside the yard. Everyone's in on the action tonight, baby. can take teams right out of their rhythm, Brad. Let's see what happens here. The Cougars have a special roster, which I know you're in love with, Dick. Oh, their roster is pretty special, Brad. You know why? Because of the seniors, the leaders, the dependable ones. They're so important. He shoots from the top of the key. The Cougars have got to continue to get him the ball. They need to keep feeding him the ball. It's simple. There's the trap. They strip him in a basketball. Got a little too fancy. Too much mustard there, baby. We've got a blowout so far, folks. Hey, when you're down this much late, you have to make sure you don't fall into any bad habits. You have to treat this like a practice now in front to take it away. He shoots from the baseline. Makes it. Picked out of the air. move with a face up. I tell you one thing, Brad, I like guys that are versatile in that post. Facing up is a way to take advantage of three basic moves. The Cougars have a hot hand right now that's scoring for them at the moment. Brad, he's on fire. Good job defensively. They just won't give him any openings. Pressure in the basketball. But inside. Unloads a three. The Cougars have found a player who cannot seem to miss Dick. They need to keep feeding him the ball. It's simple. Let's go to the third member of our broadcast team. Here's Aaron Andrews. Well, Brad, as you can imagine, I am seeing a completely different attitude on the bench now than I did in the first half. The coaching staff and players, they just have looks of disbelief on their faces. Thanks, Aaron. Dick, he's in a serious rhythm. Hey, that's because he's getting the ball in rhythm, Brad. Very important. Gave it up with a deep shot from outside. He buries the shot. <laughs> Moving it around the perimeter. Dick, a great battle down in the low post, but I think the offense is gaining ground here. Yeah, he's getting great inside position. Has the great angle. He's got him set up perfectly for a basket. They got the 45-degree angle, which is essential when entering the ball to the post.
gave it up. And the ball goes out of play. Boy, assisted turnover ratios are big, and that's a big turnover. I'll tell you, they're turning the ball over too often. You can't win when you do that. Great pressure, great double team, really explosive. He comes away with it. There was no doubt about that one. He strokes it, gets the J to fall. Definitely a foul. Oh, and you can tell by the look on his face, he wasn't expecting the whistle on him. Wow, look at the facial expression. He says, me? Here's a flash from the high post. On the dribble, gives it up. Tries for two. Sweet looking shot. He is super. He really is. He squares up down on the low block. I tell you, teach your player to face up and get in triple threat position. You can drive, shoot, or you can pass. Steals the ball. Trying to get that ball movement, get that good spacing. Picks off the lazy pass. He launches a three. Got it. Entry pass in the paint. Pushing that basketball, help one another, communicate. Takes away the pass. Up it inside. There they come with a double team to stop it. Puts it up, looking for contact. Perfectly executed. There's a double team waiting there. Stolen away. They're going to need a miracle to get a victory in this one now. That's all she wrote, Brad. This one is a done deal. Here's a double team. He's got an open look for the shot. Shoots from outside. The Cougars have got to continue to get him the ball. That he's on fire. Stolen. For the bucket. Can't get the shot to drop. Rims out. In and out. This defense really showing that they're not afraid to get physical. Hey, they're making them sweat on offense by taking chances, Brad. They'd like to get it inside to the low block. Unable to so far. Nice job of packing it in defensively. Yeah, really doing a great job packing it in and a great job of anticipating that lateral pass. Goes for the deep one. The Cougars have a hot hand right now that's scoring for them at the moment. They need to keep feeding them the ball. It's simple. Makes an outstanding block. There's the trap. He shoots from outside. Dick, these guys are tearing it up from the three-point line. Give me more threes, please. I love watching these kids drop the trifecta. 
Double team now, bad angle. He puts up the tray. That's good. Gave it up. This whole team that's on the floor is quick. But so is the defense, and they do a nice job. He shoots from the top of the circle. He buries the shot. Now they work it around the perimeter. He lets it fly. He's good for another score. Hands in his face. Any time now, boys? Tries a jump hook. He bangs it in for another score. And the hits just keep coming on, baby. Fronts him first, Dick, and then works behind. Yeah, he's playing from behind him because that tells me right there they don't respect him as an offensive player. And they made an error, obviously. But they don't have the great respect, so they're saying, you know what? Let him get the ball and let him try to beat us. Tries to spin away from the defender. I tell you, he's versatile in the post. He's got the spin move and a number of other activities. They work the perimeter. Outside jumper. Sinks the shot. Oh, Screener took some punishment setting that pick. Well, Dick, sometimes statistics lie, but in this tournament game, I don't think they do. The better team won, and they're going up. Well, I tell you, won this game rather than look at it and analyze it because they really had all the right people shoot the ball at the right moment. They did a terrific job offensively. Let's take a look at that State Farm drive of the game, Dick. Hey, the ability to get to the paint is one thing, Brad, but he also demonstrated the ability to finish as well. That's awesome, baby, with a capital A. Washington State just wanted it a little bit more in this game, and because of that, they